Hey y'all, it's KJ. Welcome back to my channel. Today is Monday, so of course we're planning out this week. Today, if you saw on my Instagram, it was a trick question. We're using Happy Planner and Whimsy Lux today, kind of pulling in a mix of some of the Happy Planner florals and then the Whimsy Lux June pages, and then a little bit of washi. I really love how this spread came together. I think all the stickers are so beautiful and it feels very summery. It is the first official week of summer. Tuesday the 21st is like officially, officially the first day of summer. So I wanted it to feel like I was on vacation this week. I'm not, but it, it looks like it. <laughs> um, of course, we're gonna do our boxes first. Start off with that, do a little zigzag, kind of figure out what we're wanting, the theme and pages to look like. I love this really mustard yellow with the light pink and the dark blue. I feel like they complement each other so well. And I think that this, these pages from Whimsy Lux are just so beautiful. I love every month. I know I say that all the time, but it's seriously so good. So this is one of those things that I do. I'm not sure if it's weird. I think it looks cool, but what I'll do is I'll go ahead and cut out a like corner of a sticker so that it lays perfectly in the corner of the squares. And I feel like it looks layered without having the see-through of some of the flower underneath. I don't know, but I do like it. So how are y'all? What do you have going on? How's your week? I know we're kind of like deep into summer now. The busy schedules with kids and friends and family are on the calendars. I know that we have a very busy upcoming few weeks and I'm really excited. It's all fun stuff. So I'm not complaining, but it is just a lot that I want to get um, planned out. So this week in particular and next week, I'm really going a little bit more into detail with my planning. So usually in a week, I'm not super rigid on when I do laundry or when I necessarily clean the house and stuff like that. Like those little tasks that I just need to get done. But we, or I, not me and my husband, but I have a pretty tight schedule these next few weeks. And so I'm kind of planning out not by the minute, but really by the day and making sure that everything on the lists are getting done everything's getting cleaned you know there's a lot to do for social media for my job and I just want to make sure that I get it all finished my business as well so I am going to be planning out very detailed for uh, probably until the first week of July when we're in New York just so that I can make sure I'm getting everything done and I think that's okay I think that we kind of go through phases of how rigid we are in our lives I try not to be that way all the time I used to really struggle with being like a control freak and not having any flexibility so I try not to plan to that level however if there's so much going on that I need to make like all 16 hours of the day work then I will do that just for the time being so that I can be productive or you know the most productive not makes sense I just don't like to make it feel like it has to be done because there's I can do it another day like I just like to be more flexible in my time these days but anyways busy few weeks so we're gonna kind of get down and figure it all out get it all in the planner day by day I've got all my social media content planned out I have some fun stuff coming out this week with pixel paper we're gonna be running a summer sale tomorrow on Tuesday to kick off summer officially and then by next week I'll be in New York for a week and my sweet wonderful precious mother is going to be running pixel paper for the week while I'm gone shipping out any orders and stuff so I'm so appreciative for her but just so you know the shop won't be closing down or anything if there's something you've been eyeing and want to participate in the sale this week go ahead and do that maybe extend it into the first week of July I'm not sure yet but just wanted to let you know nothing will be stopping I have a great team around me and I appreciate everyone and y'all so that's where we're at <laughs> little life update just kind of what's going on okay enough rambling about me I wanted to check back in with the spread how do y'all like it what are you thinking I did something pretty different for this weekend as you saw I did like the cut around and did kind of like a, a little I don't know a collage around my weekend box and I actually really like it I usually do the weekend a little different and I'll put the box like maybe to the right or the left and then a design on one side. I like though that it feels very cohesive and big with all of the summer items around it. It's kind of great. I do wish I had a little sticker that said like the weekend in pink or something or yellow that I could have put over that top just to kind of signify it's the weekend. I feel like I'm missing those stickers 
and I, I like stickers like I used to in my vertical planners, put those, the weekend stickers or stuff like that, just calling out the weekend. So I may create some of those for my horizontal planner. I'll keep you posted. Okay, now looking at some of the fun things we have going on this week on today, Monday, my mom's coming over. We're gonna go over some, like how to ship out orders and stuff, just a little tutorial and get, get some lunch, hang out, do some crafty things. I am only going to work out twice this week, probably like a more low impact walk. I'm on my period and after getting off the pill last year, I have endometriosis. My periods, I mean, are debilitating. They have become like, I almost need to block off time to just deal with them. So all that to say that this week I'll take it pretty easy and we'll just do some light walks. Like I said, Tuesday is the first day of summer. I love the summer. Oh my gosh, I just feel in my element. Although I'm not like someone that gets tan or really wears like sw summer clothes, like I'm always in jeans. I just, <laughs> I love the summer. Anyways, so this weekend on Friday, I want to get the bedding washed. So I'm trying to make a little bit of a routine in that sense. Like on Mondays, I'll do clothes. Wednesdays I'll do blankets and then Fridays I can do any clothes and bedding That's kind of what I was thinking We'll see if I can get a little bit of a laundry system going and then I'm gonna go to my mom's this weekend on Friday That's what I call the ranch. They live out in the country and then on Saturday My aunt is actually building a lake house a few hours away and me my cousin my mom and my aunt We're all really close and we are gonna go have a tour of the town that she's moving to, go get a look at the build. It's very fresh still, but it'll be fun to go see, kind of just get like an idea of what we're going to be doing in the future because we'll spend so much fun time there. So I'm really excited to go do that. And then some habits, of course, the usual. We're going to work out twice this week, not three times. We're going to take it easy, listening to my body. We're going to try with our uh, self-care this week, more focus on that, water, make sure I'm drinking enough water, making the bed, and then supplements, which I've really been struggling with for some reason the last few weeks. Not sure why, but yeah. And that's it. Our week is planned out, prepped. We have all the fun, beautiful stickers. Don't forget, as I mentioned, tomorrow we'll be having a nice and big summer sale over on the Pixel Paper Store on Etsy. And I hope you'll have a great week. On Friday, we should be doing the intro to stickers so you can learn about what the heck are planner stickers, kind of get a better understanding and perspective on how I use them. So I'm excited to share. I hope you'll have a great week and I'll see you Friday. Bye y'all. Happy planning.